Well, it's St. Patrick's Day, and I'm going to make something special. But first, does anybody know what a leprechaun eats? A blarney sandwich. So, let's get down to the business. We're going to make a chaffle, but it's going to be a Reuben chaffle. But it's not going to be a sandwich. The chaffle itself is going to be the Reuben. So stick around and see if Mike screws this up. Okay, so the Reuben is going to be the chaffle. What I've done is I've got my cheese kind of on here and I've, I've broken up about a, not quite two slices of cheese in this and I've got uh, about two tablespoons, well three tablespoons probably of uh, canned corned beef, one egg, caraway seeds, probably about a quarter to a half a teaspoon of caraway seeds to make it the rye bread taste. And I put in some uh, sauerkraut, which I've got probably a heaping tablespoon of sauerkraut in it. So now we're gonna put this on here and make our chaffle. Uh-oh, well, I couldn't screw it up, but Mike started making a mess. So, Maybe Mike won't screw this too up, too badly up. But I put the cheese on the griddle itself, on the waffle griddle, because um, it just does better. It helps it to do it, to do what it's got to do to be a chocolate. Let me kind of level that out a little bit here. Now, the um, sauerkraut, I did drain it real good, squeeze the juices out of it so it would not be too wet in here, and we'll, we'll see if it works. I drained this up in my head, and in my head, this worked like a champ, so we'll see if my head's warped a little bit or... I don't have myself a brainstorm. One never knows with me. Let's close her up. Let her cook up. All right. We'll come back when these are done. To clarify, um, what I, the cheese I put in was Swiss cheese. And she's doing nicely so far. Doing quite nice. Well, hopefully it'll come together and be good. So stick around. The screw up may still come. Let's sneak a peek. Ooh, I wish you look. That coming together nice. All right. Let's close it up. It needs to go a little longer, I think. I like that. All right. I pronounce these done. Put them over here to cool for just a minute. All right. They are done. I'm going to unplug that. I'll clean them later and we'll stand by for the taste so to recap this is a Reuben in a chaffle the chaffle is the Reuben so I put Swiss cheese about a slice and a half near maybe well with what I put on top and bottom on the griddle that it would have been too about two slices, two full slices. I used about three tablespoons of canned corned beef, one egg, a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, um, 
about a probably between a quarter and a half of uh, caraway seeds to give it that rye bread taste and a heaping tablespoon of drained sauerkraut. You got to drain it, otherwise this thing is not going to be crisp. It, it's just not going to do it. So I've got some Russian dressing here that I've made. Let's just see how she turned out. Dip her in there. <laughs> Dang. Folks, I'm, I'm amazed. That, that turned out well. Pardon me if I got it on my face, but that's good. That is so good. Wow. Wow. Russian dressing is real simple. I did not make it complicated. Real close to make a thousand island. I put equal parts of ketchup and mayo. Um, and I put some dill relish in it. And I added some seasonings, uh, which ranch... I mean, not ranch, but Thousand Island and Russian, they're real close to the same. I know that classic Russian head does usually have a little bit of horseradish in it, but didn't have any. Plus, my wife won't eat the horseradish. But this, wow. <laughs> I'm telling you. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Make it, make this. Oh man, now I could have, maybe put a teaspoon of caraway seeds. Maybe a teaspoon, but wow. I, I'm so pleased with that. All right, well this bike key riffy journey saying, let's be careful out there and wish somebody you don't know a good day and have them, tell them to have a good day. Till the next time, let's be careful out there. So I brought Paige one of the chaffles, serving it to her. She loves it. You might be able to hear her in the background. Mm. Oh my <laughs> God, this is so good. <laughs> you hear? She's loving it. She took one oh. bite and she's like, oh my God, what's in this? This is so good. So mm. y'all got to make this. Mm.